Where are you from? Uh, well, you know, originally um, you know, Mexican descent, and um, you know, but came here legally and everything. You came here how? Uh, legally. How is that? Well, you know, going through the paperwork and the process, the legal processes and stuff like that. Did your parents come here illegally? Uh, they came here legally. Legally through the process and everything. To sh How do they feel about people jumping the line? Uh, very upset about it because, um, you know, it just basically is like a middle finger in the face to, to you know, uh, people, you know, doing it the right way and obeying the American laws, you know. Are there many Latino Americans who feel the same way? Yes, I, I believe they, they do. You know, um, some may, may not come out and say anything. Maybe they're just afraid of ridicule or something like that. But, you know. Why aren't there more Latinos here at the uh, supportive of the uh, administration protest, uh, counter protest? Really? You know, maybe, I don't know, maybe they don't know about it or maybe it's interesting. Uh, I mean, I didn't even know about it, but, you know, I, that's why I saw it and I'm like, I'm willing to you know, say something so people could see because if people want to say and stereotype, oh, only Trump supporters are just white supremacists and that couldn't be further from the truth, you know? I mean, uh, that's not a white supremacy, you know? Donald Trump is our president. The American people have spoken and, you know, we come from Mexico and it's like, you know, Mexico, we come from there because it's not good over there. And then, you know, why come over here and try to recreate Mexico? I mean, it's insane. It's like, you know, if a person likes Mexico so much, go back. I mean, th this is not, you know, any native land. I mean, the dinosaurs were here first, and then, you know, evolution and people, you know, conquer all over the world. I mean, we don't live in the past. That's mental illness. It is what it is now, and now we have laws. And it's like, if, if people keep talking about white man this, white man that, the opposition side, it's like, well, then get rid of your driver's license. Get rid of your social security number. Don't live in an apartment. Don't drive a car. Don't take the bus. Don't go to the grocery store. Don't, you know, I mean, that's all what they would consider the white man's evil stuff. Well, then why do they participate in that then? Why are they trying to get a job and work? That's the white man stuff, you know? It's the so-called white man stuff. It's just, it doesn't make any sense. It's like, um, take responsibility, you know, for your, your actions and your life and, and stuff like that. Don't stop blaming people and, and stuff like that. And Trump is our president. God bless Donald Trump, you know. Build that wall, make it 10 feet higher. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Make that wall, build that wall, you know. Do, do everything, you know. Make California great again, make America great again, and God bless Donald Trump, straight up.